Namaste. I am so happy that you are ready for your day one. Are you excited as I am? Good. So first posture is the very foundation of your yoga journey and it will take you all the way to your lightness. No matter how you look, you will feel lighter. And the journey starts from feeling. Once you feel lighter, you can have your body completely transformed to look lighter. So let us begin with the first step, which is Tadasana. And Tadasana is mountain pose. We are going to talk about how to position your toes, how to position your feet. So first thing is, just take a deep breath. And be aware of your breath. Now I'm completely sure that you're here. Then next step, you're gonna go, move your attention on your toes. And how are you going to do it? You will lift all your toes up. So you're lifting your toes up. And can you see beneath the neck of my toes, the mounted portion? So that's the mounds of your toes. And you're going to press that mount on floor. Once you do that, you will feel stretch in your thighs, in your back thighs, in your core, in your buttocks. And then that's the time you place all the toes down, but keep pressurizing those mounds. And that's the complete one lesson for Tarasana. You may take a couple of hours to practice that. And some people take a couple of years to practice same Tarasana. And that's the very basis. That's the foundation and English name for this posture is mountain pose. So you'll get the stability as mountain. You won't move, you'll be stable. And right now when you're doing it, I'm sure that you are there. You're feeling some stretch. This is only first day, a few minutes, but I know you are going to get it. And do share with me how you're feeling it, where the stretch is, where the tuck is and right now while I'm doing it, while talking to you, my attention is on my feet, spe specifically on the mounts of my toes and that's what I'm pressing down. I'm allowing it to go down deeper and getting rooted. So that's getting rooted is very important here. So that's Tarasana and you practice it say for five times today, 30 seconds each, a minute each, or 20 seconds each, whatever your time is. We'll grow organically and we'll see how fast you're growing once you leave everything on your body. So that's one. Another thing is from Tarasana, you'll, do pra you'll practice Tarasana and after you are in Tarasana, meaning your attention is on your toes, I want you to bring your attention on your center of your heel. And that's a tricky thing. That how I'm gonna find the center of my heel. It's tricky, but it's not difficult. So you are going to press the center mentally, mindfully. This action is not physical action. You have to bring your mind there in the sole of your feet and that's what you're pressing. And after some days you'll get control of it. You'll get the mastery over this posture and we have this posture every day. So this is only day one. And the second posture today is chair pose, Utkatasana. So in Utkatasana, you move your pelvis down as if some high rise chair is there and keep your hands on the center top thighs and you bring your pelvis down. Bring it down, bring it down. I'm going to show you the side view as well. And those who are feeling heavy, or those who are having bigger bodies, what's the um, improvisation for them? I remember when I first started, I had to use wall, and this is what I would recommend for you. So I'll give you a side view so that you are aware what not to do. So let me take you there. So I'm going to show you side view. The first posture is Tarasana. So you will stand in Tarasana, you lift your toes up, pressurizing the mounds and then bring the toes down. After that, you bring your pelvis down as if some high rise chair is there. And if this is your level, just stick to that. Otherwise you can go down, down, down more. So what I am feeling while bringing my pelvis down 
There is stretch in thighs, there is stretch in buttocks, there is stretch contraction in core. And this is what you need to know. So I was talking about what not to be done. If you are jutting this lower back out by virtue of moving your tailbone out, that's not allowed. So if it's like this, if you are moving here, so that's not allowed, then I would suggest you to go to wall. So choose any corner, what's the first day instruction? So here. You select your wall and then move one foot out and move other foot out. From here, just go slowly down. And here, because you have wall as your guru, your support, so you can go down a little more. And once you're going down, you can maximum you can bring your knees and pelvis aligned. But today, you can be here. So gradually we move. So best part is your back is, lower back is completely supported by wall. That's the best part. And you're getting all the benefits of both the worlds. That you're getting the stretch and you're getting the support. So this is going to be the second posture, which is Utkatasana after Tarasana. And here you stay for some seconds, wherever you can hold normally without straining your system, just hold for that much time. And in the posture, try to relax your shoulders. And notice what's happening with you. So this is not like doing any exercise or gymming. Yoga is only be considered yoga when your mind is here. Otherwise, that would be considered as any other exercise. And I want you to do yoga, very organic yoga, where your mind is there. Yoga meaning is to unite. And who's uniting with whom? You uniting with your body. You are your mind and soul. And your body is the medium. So right now, my attention is on the basis, which is Tarasana, on my soles. Mounds of the toes I'm pressing, center of the heel I'm pressing. And because I'm pressing my roots, I'm rooted, I'm grounded. The benefit, the freebie is on my thighs, on my tummy. You can see I have a little flap, but right now it's getting in, it's getting in, there is zero, you know. So initially when I had three tires here, I would feel the same, that it will get in. It's uh, the internal feeling is that I'm having tuck in. So rather than your appearance, you're feeling something which is deep inside. So with that note, if you wanna come back, Come back, come back, and then take support and go slowly. So bring your feet together and then one foot back, other foot back, use your caution. Use, be safe. And after doing this posture, especially without, I have done with wall and even now I'm feeling increase in my cardio. So you choose whether you wanna run on your treadmill or you did this posture for less than two minutes or you want to stay in a posture, save all your time and get the maximum benefit out of it. And more instructions are there in your email, like how many times you would do it. And for any questions, any doubts, your wins and challenges, do join the Facebook group, which is Weight Loss The Yoga Way and tag me. Thank you so much. See you soon.